Chris, it was a difficult game in the end, but uh, a fruitful result. Yeah, it was a good workout on uh, a real difficult pitch. You know, it's uh, it's a newly laid 3G. It's not too old, but still, I think um, you know, being here, um, it's quite a unique place and um, a fantastic setting with the rock um, sort of in the background of of the uh, of the pitch. But you know, physically, again, a good test. But I think it was more the mental aspect today for the players because of. Uh, playing on quite a, a tricky surface but they handled it well you know I must say um, you know we we had to make sure there's a few players we didn't want to put at risk you know with sort of their historical injuries but the players that um, played you know in both halves you know young Jordan Cousins had to play 90 minutes uh, I thought he was outstanding today but we got a great start Callum Harriet um, very very early on and, um, you know, we, they made us work hard for the result. They had a little spell of pressure when they hit the bar. Um, but in the end, it was a, a really well-worked goal um, with Joe Piggott and Michael Smith combining and uh, Bradley Pritchard finishing it off. So, you know, I'm pleased, clean sheet. Hopefully we're unscathed. We'll see in the morning um, because it is a surface that really tests your muscles and this early on, it's uh, not great for us, but, you know, the players have experienced playing in Gibraltar, you know, travelling here uh, to a place that, uh, you know, is quite well renowned. And now they've got their, their UEFA status as well. So it was a big game for them. Well attended. You know, we had a few Charlton fans and we've come away with uh, results. So I'm pleased. Were you surprised? I mean, for a friendly match, it was quite a relatively hostile environment for the fan fans. Wise. Were you, were you, uh, were you surprised at the test? Were you surprised at the turnout? Well, it's a big game for them, you know, a big game for the, uh, it's like a small island as such, you know, and uh, I suppose when any visiting team comes from England, it's, uh, it's a big moment. Obviously, there's a lot of expats here, so, um, you know, they turned out in force. There's a lot of singing, drums, and uh, they were singing songs at me. I'm not too sure what they were saying, but, you know, there you go. But, um, you know, I felt the players handled it. There was a few... Rough tackles. I mean, they gave us a yellow card for something innocuous. Jordan Cook nearly got snapped in half and there was nothing. You've got to get used to this sometimes when you play away. You know, it's those sort of tests that you have in Europe. So, you know, the players were, um, I felt, were very, very calm and composed in uh, what was quite a hostile atmosphere at times. But they were very friendly. I thought the people uh, were very welcoming to us and to my players and staff. and. You know, we're very happy that uh, we've done it. You know, now we will uh, you know, just gone up another level in our fitness. Um, you know, another win, which is always good for us. You know, regardless of what game it is, a win's a win. And winning mentality is what you want to breed. And we move on now to St Mirren uh, on Saturday. So, um, very pleased with it all.